Hello everyone, you're welcome to this video. So for those that want to migrate abroad to settle or you want to move abroad, you know, for whatever reason you may have, right? Study is one of the easiest routes to make it abroad. Regardless of which country you want to go to, study is the easiest. So in this video, I want to show you schools you can apply to and get a scholarship you school study for free. So this video is basically about how to study abroad for free all right so i'm going to be showing you the schools to apply and you know just all the details involved the website you know what is needed if you need ielts or not you know just everything you need to apply to move on the study route and to do it without breaking the bank so stick with me in this video where i'll be showing you everything if we are just meeting my name is jackie and you're welcome to the channel do subscribe if you want to be seeing more videos like this on this channel i share information that is going to help you in your relocation journey whether you want to move abroad for work or for study or you just want to go live in a different country i have information that is going to help you with this so do subscribe to the channel and also turn on the post notification bell so you know every time i share a new video and if you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for always coming back. Thanks for the support. I truly appreciate you. And if you want to talk to me personally, I have a one-on-one -on -one consultation. So you can send me an email so we can get to talk about your own personal needs. All right, so let's get straight into the video. All right, so let's look at this school. This is an amazing school. And um, quick facts about the school. 100% of students receive financial assistance, right? So that is just major. And that is why I'm bringing this school to you. So 100% of students admitted to this school receive financial assistance. So once you get admission to this school, you can be sure to get financial assistance. So you don't need to break the bank to school here because they have a whole lot of financial aid available for every student that is admitted to this school. And I'm going to show you some of them later. And then they have an 11 to 1 student to faculty ratio. And it's the number one best small college in West Virginia. And they have 24 areas of study in the school. And 84% of graduates are employed within one year of graduating. 53 study abroad countries. All right, so this is a very good school application. It is free. It is free to apply to this school as a fresher, that is as an undergraduate, right? And um, yeah, so let's just go through this website and see what the school has to offer. So for incoming freshmen, they have a rolling admission, you know, they have a rolling admission here, meaning there's no deadlines. You can apply for admission at any time. And as they've said here, you know, you would get your decision within two weeks. So within two weeks, you get your admission in this school okay so that is just an important fact to understand and then incoming freshman admission checklist complete an admi admission application submit official high school and if applicable college transcripts submit official ACT or, or SAT scores which is optional and all of that okay and it's it's an online application everything is done online you submit all your supporting documents by email right so it's really 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 amazing okay so let's see all the details let's look at what they have for international students right so they're open to international students and um, there's a link here to click to begin your application so what you need to do is to complete your admission application online through this form and then you will submit official copies of academic records from your secondary school. And um, next up is if you intend to request transfer credit for previous post-secondary school work, submit official copies here. English language proficiency must be demonstrated for any student whose native language is not English and did not attend a secondary school in which English was the language of instruction, all right? So if, you're, if you were taught in English in your previous, you know, school, either secondary school or university, if you were taught in English, you don't need to prove your English language proficiency, right? And if your native language is English, you don't need to, to prove your English proficiency as well. So if at all, 
you fall under the people that need to prove this. You need to do TOEFL, IELTS, or Duolingo. They do accept Duolingo as well. All right. And then you download, complete, and submit the declaration of financial support form. And then you submit a copy of the identification page of your passport. So those are the things you need to submit as an international applicant. So let's look at the areas of study. It's quite a lot. So there are 12 academic departments, 24 areas of study, 34 majors, 33 minors, and seven pre-professional programs. So this is the list of them. The majors are accounting, biology, chemistry, professional chemistry, biochemistry, communication and arts, integrated media and marketing, digital media and production, graphics, sports communication, computer science, criminal justice, cybersecurity. There are a lot of them. So this is a whole list. So you can go through it to see what it's in there for you. There, there ought to be something for everybody. This is, you know, a wide list. So there will be something for you or close to something you want in this school, right? And these are the minors right here. And then the pre-professional programs, medical and health professionals, pre-art therapy, pre-engineering, pre-law, pre-occupational therapy, pre-physical therapy. And then let's see the graduate application. So if you want to apply for a graduate program, these are them. You can apply for MBA apply for Master of Education in Teaching and Learning. So these are the two areas you can apply for here. All right, so you can apply for an MBA or you apply. So if you want to apply for an MBA, this is what you need to do. Fill out the application form below, which will require a current CV or resume, an official copy of current transcript, and then two references, right? All right, so that's it. So that's about this school. So let's look at financial aid. Yeah, financial aid. There are a lot of scholarships here, scholarships, grants, and loans, right? So they are available to every student. 100% of students receive financial assistance, as they say here. So there is something for everyone. So let's look at scholarships real quick. Let's just see the scholarships available. So the link to this will be in the description. So you can go to this school and see all the information for yourself. So there's a presidential scholarship. So this is the details for the presidential scholarship. And then there is the Cullen Scholarship, right? Honors Program, which is $25,000. Merit Scholarships. Alumni scholarships, choral scholarship, band scholarship, you know, it's quite a lot. So as far as they've said, 100% of students receive financial aid. I mean, that's a good thing. So you definitely get financial aid in this school. All right, so go through the website, see other information that you need to know. So there is a whole lot of places where you can click to apply. There is apply all over the place. So just click on any of them to apply to this school. I hope you found that valuable. If you did, do give this video a thumbs up. That is a like. So others that need this kind of information will get to see the video. All right. And also subscribe to the channel if you've not done that already. Thank you so much for watching. My name is Jackie and I will see you in my next video.